All right, I'm back from Planet Coaster, and today we are going to be building the fourth and final little arena. Well, I guess it wouldn't be. I'd say it's medium size because these are small. It's the large one. It'll be medium, and it'll look similar to the original idea that we've had, with a little tweaks so it fits in with this theme. Now, ideas going forward that I've thought of while I was doing the time lapses for last episode. Um, was, you'll be, you have to get up into the arena from this way, so you have to have the interaction of walking across, which I will get into what I'm doing here in a second. Uh, you go across, that's how you get in. Obviously we have a fake entrance and everything, but, and that's where the coaster is going to be that goes inside the mountain and has like the underground death trap stuff. Uh, whenever you're done on the coaster, still haven't decided if that's the coaster I'm going to use yet, you will then come out an entrance from the back, get all the way past here, this will be interactive so they can walk across. We'll get some use out of this as I built this like 40 episodes ago. And you'll come out here. That's why I was building that before, just to test out. That'll be changed to fit uh, level with this. So there's that. So that's how you exit. Now, the plan for this here is... I didn't put a roof on this because I'm going to have a, a part of the mountain overhanging this. So it kind of comes over this a bit and we're gonna have like lanterns hanging down from chains off of that so it adds extra lighting to that across so maybe not both of them maybe one of them uh this i might change to one full roof this is just an experiment and what else is i gonna say oh yes i can't add because i was gonna add a roof to this originally but then i realized the shape of this is off by just enough to where i don't think i can build a proper roof if i can it's going to look weird. So I think overhanging some mountain will be just fine. Because like I said, we are going to bring this whole thing up. And it's going to be somewhat of a big mountain to look at from the distance. And what else did I want to say? Oh yes, we're going to be adding a ride in here. Not, not a coaster. God, where was it? Try to find this quick. Trying to go through all this really fast before I start building today. Was it this one? Yes, we're going to be putting this here, which would be a nice contrast to the giant one we put over there. So instead of that being the, you know, the giant ride with the backdrop of that stuff, we're going to have the backdrop of the mountain with this little medium-sized thing in the middle, and we're going to decorate up the inside, uh, all nice and stuff. But that'll be the last step, because I want to get all this done around the edge first. So, anything else that I missed that I want to talk about before I start building... No. Okay, we're good. So, this will be a separate building. Maybe not. <laughs> Let me see how the grid lines up with this here, whenever it wants to cooperate. See, that might, that might just be perfect to start with. Just right along there, I don't have to mess with anything. We'll do that. Now let me try to figure out how many, it's two, three, try to get to the edge of this. How far over does that go? It kind of starts there. Well, that's good enough. One, two, three, one, two, three, two, three, two, three, four. Hmm. That might... It might work. You know, funnily enough, this might be the smallest one of all of them, actually. But it's going to be more pushed in. But I think the scale of what it's going to be is going to be fine. Should I get a measurement for this? Because I don't know. I mean, these kind of line up a little bit, but it's, it's off just slightly. Maybe I should make it its own thing. I think that's what I'll do. Change my mind. Make it its own thing. So I say we'll start it there. Now, let me just build this over all the way across because I, I'm going to be deleting a lot of this. But I need this as like a, a blueprint for the entrance we're going to make. And luckily, if this is going to end up being too close to the path, I can just delete it. Okay, I had to move that in. And I was building a basic outline of what I wanted. Because what we're going to have is 
some of those little oh god what are they called i put them over here i don't know i don't know the word for it it's going to look like that only smaller instead of it being the two block ones it's going to be the one block uh, arches how high they're going to go i don't know yet because i kind of want you to see in and i don't want it to be overshadowing everything else so it may be the same height or one block higher than what we have um oh that's right i need the bottom ones i need this in place of that well, let me put that there for a second. Because I always like that more. I feel like it adds a lot. So let me do that real quick. We'll add those in. Uh, a lot of this is on the fly, to be honest. I, I try to come up with an idea, and then I just... I'm like, okay, that's enough for me to make an episode out of, and I just try to go with it. Since this is going to be a fake entrance, it doesn't really matter if it's perfectly lined up or not, so fuck it. Who cares? As long as it's uh, even on each side. So where are these arches at? The one block arches. I don't want the pointy ones. Or maybe I do. Because, you know, I haven't used pointy ones at all, really. Other than, like, a few entrances for uh, some walkways and stuff. Everything else has been pretty rounded. So, you know what? I think I might go pointy on this one. Maybe there would be fine. Oh, not there. That's for sure. Have four there. Okay. That's one block higher, and then we get the little we get the height going. So they're not the same all the way around. I'm okay with it. If it would select the fourth one. Yeah, that's something I can work with. And at the corner here, I want to have another small, well, it will be small compared to the middle ones, a little tower. Might be circular, might be square, but I'm just putting that there for now as a marker. This is a, very similar to the original idea of the Colosseum, but as you see, this is going almost the same way of very unorganized garbage. <laughs> That's what I'm used to. Why? Why are you doing this to me, game? Just leave it flat. <sighs> Fucker. Every time. Do I have to get rid of you guys first for this to even work? Because I was trying a little, just a little design at the bottom just to make it look different. Jesus Christ. Okay. Because maybe it won't change after I get them in there. You never know. If it does, then we'll have to figure out something else. Okay, now if I add you in. Why? Just don't do that. Is there like an option to shut that off? <laughs> Why does it do that? All right, well, that's not going to work. Because I didn't want to just bring them to the ground, but it looks like I might as well at this point. Hi, ah, yes, I'd like to find out why the fuck you're doing this and not lining up like every other thing I've tried in this park. Oh my god. What? I always get troubles with this, and it drives me insane. Like, why all of a sudden now do you not want to line up? You did it. I can literally copy this over, and it doesn't line up now. Oh, now you... Okay, see? Once you yell at it, it listens. That's not touching the ground, is it? Nope, that one's not. Well, we'll fix that. Fix that now, just so we don't have any problems. Go down. Now that lowers the whole grid, so everything's going to be all stupid now. Okay, no, I did not want that. I want this. Thank you. Okay, now line up. Thank you. Now, do you line up on this side? Why? Why do you not line up on this side? Okay, well, that's why, because I had to flip it over. Still. See, the cool thing about this is I can... It's going to be a bit uneven. 
of an arena. It's not going to look symmetrical for the most part because I kind of want seats to go up higher and that's going to go into the mountain a little bit, which I'm okay with, but it's just going to look a little different. That way so I can vary it up a bit. But for the most part, this, the bottom design is going to look the same. It's just there might be extra seats on the left side and the back compared to this side. So, there's that. Hmm, interesting. I hope that doesn't fuck up anything whenever I lift it up. It does. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. Alright. We'll delete that. <laughs> well, can... No, not control exit. We'll just exit. Up into here. As long as that goes up without poking through, like that's doing right there. So right about there. Then we'll bring it down. We'll control X and bring it down like right there. Okay, that's not bad. Then we'll just do that. Why are you higher all of a sudden? God, just shoot me, please. Select grid. This grid. I don't know. I don't fucking know. We'll just control exit over. I was trying to do it the other way, but it's just not cooperating, so... Nope, not control Z. Oh my god. <laughs> fucking, seriously, just shoot me. Select it, please. Thank you. It's a love-hate relationship with the with this game. I love the building aspect, but my god. Sometimes the controls just drive me crazy. And I know that was my fault that I pressed Control z and not Control x But still. I gotta take my frustrations out on the game somehow. Alright. So there we go. I think that'll be okay when walking up to it. Because maybe I could get circular towers here and then square towers here, but uh, it might throw off the whole... It might throw it off of the square, so... Because the squares might have to be bigger. That's not lined up. I kind of want it to be further on the outside. Maybe? Maybe not? decided on that yet. Hey, can you come back on the screen so I can, you know, X out of that? That'd be nice. You know, just, just a little bit. Filter thing, please. Could you just... Thank you. <laughs> Alright. What else can go wrong today? Hopefully I remember to save this episode. That would also be quite frustrating if I didn't. Should I turn this the other way? Because it has that line across, and I think that'll fit well. Might make it just go all the way across for the moment. To here. We'll see. Now we gotta build this. Oh, let's do the grid height 4, and let's select the grid of this. So we don't have any problems. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I always have problems with this. Come on, up. I'm deciding on how high I want this. It might be... I feel like this is going to switch the grid height whenever I do this. I don't know why I'm attempting it. Oh no, it's fine. It may be to there with a little roof cap, wherever that is. I believe it is this thing. I mean, it sticks with the theme of everything else we've done around this area, so, you know, why not? Especially with that, I think that'll fit in. Will it be the same color, though? I don't know, I might go with red. Okay, here's a few minor things that I did really quick. I'm gonna try to go over it because I wasted a lot of time micromanaging things. Um, 
I may put the little red cap towers on this. I think we're going to keep it red on this side and change that to maybe a full sized roof if I can. If not, we'll figure out something else for it because I think red would be fine for this section. Blue is fine for everything else. Little contrast in colors because it fits in with the theme of the red versus blue in the arena and the red and blue on the little banners that I have to hang everywhere. So that's fine. This is probably one too high. I'm going to lower that one. This. Uh, I move this in just to line it up in the middle with this it's before we copy and paste this over and then build our middle thing which well, we'll build the middle thing first and then we'll copy and paste the rest over this we'll probably have to move as well because I don't like how it's sitting here that did not select everything I hope this selects everything that's around this it didn't this is just a mess <laughs> it looks like a mess now but it'll be okay. We'll fix it. Okay, I gotta look at it from this angle because that was the problem before of having it line up. Okay, you gotta line up like right there. It might look off from the outside at the moment because I probably don't have enough of a gap to fill in. There we go. Just add another one. Right there. Yep, and now we'll just delete this. And we'll just bring this down one block. Oh, go back, please. Stop saving. <laughs> I have to do it from the side. I can never see it from the front. I'll probably still mess it up. Subtle difference in height. It's still big enough to put a door on the uh, side there. This we can get rid of. This we can get rid of. Basically all this here. There we go. Okay, now the, the entrance, which is right here. Alright, so the design for the entrance also I've copied and pasted. Just to make this a little easier for me. I know I said I wasn't going to do that, but uh, just for building purposes, it makes it a little easier on me. So, I think we'll have it at this height. And I think we'll keep the pointed arch going for that. Because I'll put in a little one meter block to fix that. So now I can probably add in... Let's do a grid height to be forward so I can get this done quickly. Put that in. Oh yeah, we'll do one side and then copy and paste it over. That's the way to do it. How quickly you forget. Yes, the one meter blocks. Where are those, where are those at? I think I'd know. I said it almost every time. Because I'm an idiot. Do you... You don't pierce through that at all, because you're a small one meter block, right? I think that... No, you don't. Okay. Perfect. I don't have to worry about anything being too specific. Now I get to mess with these things again. They're all always fun. They never mess up. And I never get confused by them. It's perfect. I'll just go all the way down. Thank you. Now can I get this side to work? Oh my god, it's a miracle. I cooperated. Alright, so now we're just gonna get all these little pieces in this. Let's see if I can select everything in one go here without fucking it up. We can just copy and copy and Copy. Copy. Come on. Just slide in. Just slide in exactly where the other one went. Thank you. Okay, so control X in these over from the uh, arches over here. If I need more than two, that's fine because I can just do that. And I'll probably delete the lower one, but I'm leaving it in for now just to check it. Try to get that as lined up as possible. Okay. 
Let's see, what does that look like if I delete that? I could leave it open slightly. You'd never be able to actually walk in there. But I think it'd be cool to leave it open. Yeah, there we go. Can I, can my camera, like, can my, can I move my camera, please? Why can't, is my middle mouse button just breaking right now? Hey, right, thank you. <laughs> there we go. Now, for the sides. Again, that's a tough one to try to figure out at the moment. Because, like I said, they're going to be two different sides. One is going to go into the mountain. What is this? Which I guess for that, they might just end up being completely different shapes. Like this one might angle off into the back. And then this one might just cut straight off into there. Because I don't know how far into the mountain... Like how much is going to be exposed in the open compared to how much is going to be covered by the by the mountainside? Because it's going to be a little bit bigger than this. I'd say maybe cut back to like right about here. But let me get this path going again. It was this one one. No, it was this one. Yeah, with the five meter. Because I was thinking maybe I could get it to to cut under. It'll cut under the stairs and the seats that are going... I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm pointing at the screen and making hand gestures. You can't see that, but... It'll cut under the seats, and then it'll come out into the middle section, similar to the other arena. Only it won't be cutting across this way. This is more just for an entrance thing. You'll be able to cut across... You'll be able to walk over a little bit and then walk the other way around. So I think I'm going to cut over to the time lapse now because I think it'll be easier to just show you in a sped up version of what my vision for this is than trying to explain it and then slowly build it. So one thing I want to check really quick before I leave is this. Do I have the space to connect this up into here for something as big as a like 10 width? I just want to make sure. Yes. Okay. So that's fine. I'm just going to leave this here as a marker. I will probably delete the hell out of that and change it completely. But, uh, ooh, that's, that might, I don't know how well that's going to go, considering I've probably fucked that up. Let me, oh yeah, I've, I fucked that really bad by deleting that little bit under there. It was seven, wasn't it? God. Well, that's something I'll worry about later. But yeah, cutting over to the time lapse now. See you there.